present moment is a little restless. They're in the gate, and they're off. Hamwood Flyer is going out to battle for the early lead. Unbridled Mary has some early foot, too, and Eddie's new dream well spotted at the rail in third. Freedom Flyer is fourth. Then Ankira racing in fifth, mid-pack, a length and a half back. Una Chiquitita in present moment are racing right together. That pair is followed by Lucky Girl, and it's another length and a half back to the trailer, Oakhurst. Around the clubhouse turn, and the loose leader is Hamwood Flyer. She's opened up about five lengths. Unbridled Mary is second by four. Then Freedom Flyer and Eddie's new dream racing right together. Ankira is on the outside next, inching a little forward with present moment racing between rivals. Una Chiquitita is next, and then it's another length back to Lucky Girl in Oakhurst. No turning back for Hamwood Flyer, who has that huge lead. It's more than six. Unbridled Mary second by the same margin. Freedom Flyer is racing in third, coming toward the quarter pole, and it's Hamwood Flyer's lead shrinking rapidly now. Unbridled Mary poised to pounce on her, and Freedom Flyer picking up some pieces on the outside. Unbridled Mary comes to take the lead. Eddie's new dream is trying to angle off the fence as Lucky Girl starts to kick into high gear. Eddie's new dream dives down toward the rail. 16th to go. Freedom Flyer got the jump. Lucky Girl, Eddie's new dream. Lucky Girl on the outside, or Freedom Flyer. Lucky Girl got up. Freedom Flyer was second. Photo for third, Unbridled Mary. And another photo, Eddie's New Dream and Oakhurst from last. In the winner's circle is Lucky Girl, a four-year-old Bay Philly by Exceed and Excel out of Abbey Angel, owned by Panic Stable, trained by Phil D'Amato, and ridden to victory by Joe Bravo. Lucky Girl was bred in Ireland by Paul Highland. Running time, 134.07 seconds. In the winner's circle, making the trophy presentation for the Swing Time Stakes is James Kasparov, Stakes Coordinator here at Santa Anita Park. Thank you very much, Frank. The nightcap, the swing time stakes went to Phil D'Amato and Lucky Girl for their connections in here, Panic Stable. Phil, I just wanted to talk to you. You've only had this filly for three starts now. The mental development that you've seen from her since you've had her. You know, a lot. I think just giving her time off from uh, two to three, I think that's really helped her. And uh, just, I think, maturity. And, and I have to give uh, my wife, uh, Sherry, a lot of uh, credit for this. She's uh, learned to, to draw or to, to gallop her and draw reins. And I think that's helped her as well. So just getting her to relax a little bit? Yeah, and just use herself, you know, all the way around. And I think you can see the progression from her races earlier in her career to now. She just finishes better, and, and she used to be a kind of filly. She'd make that big move around the turn and just kind of flatten out late. Now she just continues with that run all the way through the wire. One little note on Hamwood Flyer. Of course, we saw, you know, break through the gates early in that race. At that point, is it over? Yeah, I, I do not like that. I never see horses run well after that. It just takes that much angst out of them. And, uh, y you know, uh, with the filly like that where she's kind of uh, pace dependent, that was probably just enough to rattle her. And, and Mike said he couldn't get her to switch off after that. Maybe you need to put Sherry on her, too. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Phil Diamato wins the swing time stakes with a lucky girl for Panic Stable. That closes out the card here on this Monday holiday of racing.